السلام عليكم وعليكم السلام ورحمة الله شيخ if I wipe my ears like uh, like you told me and my thumb only touches two thirds of my outer ear is this okay because my ears wider than, than my thumb or not so if it touches four quarters or four fifths of your ear is it okay or not Yunus Yunus probably yes if it touches four fifths most likely okay uh, three quarters maybe half mm. probably I don't I don't know so what's the logic of me qu asking you these questions um, you're saying I'm, o I'm overthinking I'm saying that what is mandatory is to wipe and this is the Sunnah what percentage is not mentioned so whatever counts as wiping does the job for example we are ordered in the Quran to wipe over our heads now definitely I'm not gonna wipe every strand of hair so what's the percentage it's not mentioned whatever counts as wiping does the job so if you do this with your ear and you move on it's what Allah Azza wa told you to do you don't have to go to details as they say the devil is in the details Ahna from Bangladesh Assalamu alaikum Shaykh Assalamu Shaykh what is the ruling on going to wedding feasts where the men and women would be eating at the same room if they are not segregated if it is free mixing this is not permissible but if they are in separate tables away from one another and the women are concealed they are wearing the proper hijab there's no problem in that we go to restaurants and there's no problem in others being in the restaurant when we're eating and Allah knows best Hamza from Bosnia Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullah uh, Sheikh I know that it is not permissible to take non-Muslims as close friends there is a Christian guy who lives in another country and he comes to my country twice a year. Whenever he comes to my country, he sends me a text message asking me if he's welcome to come to my house. I don't do this for Dawah purposes, but just to catch up with him. If I accept him in my house twice a year and I don't have any types of communications with him in the meantime, would I be considered as the one who takes Christians as close friends? The answer is no. There is no problem in entertaining him twice a year casually like any other person. This is not taking them as allies or uh, uh, close confidants and there's no problem in that. Adrian from Serbia. Assalamu alaikum. Alaikum salam. So what is your opinion on the Arab revolt in the first war in the first world war? I wasn't there so I am not uh, qualified to judge or say or talk about these things besides it's like a gazillion years ago why would anyone in his sound mind would ask about the ruling of something that would not get him closer to Allah what we know is at the moment revolting against the Muslim rulers is totally prohibited by the Quran by the Sunnah by the consensus of the uh, 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 trusted scholars shall we say because we've seen what it resulted in the past 15 years devastation chaos people cannot travel cannot go to school cannot live they're mis displaced all over the country and their passports has no, have no value what benefit did they gain show me one country that benefited from such revolt and, and, and rebellion so this is what the, the, the Sunnah tells us not to do and whoever defies it will find and face the consequences. May Allah protect us.